YouTube. I haven't done a vlog in a while. Um, and I thought it might do my head good to do one right now. I didn't check my check my Google traffic to see uh, where the traffic was for heading out. That's not good. Howard Air with a replacement repair called Howard Air. That's not good at all. seem to get going. Um, you know, can't seem to turn on and go. Uh, I watching videos about homelessness in California, in, in LA specifically, you know, different places I didn't go. And to watch more videos of areas that I went that I liked and I, such as it was I was really happy and optimistic down on Venice Beach I've been neither of those things since I've been back in Phoenix um, let's see I, I did shoot a vlog I'm trying, to, trying to remember it's been a really life's been kind of a blurry cloud since I got back so I can forget to check traffic I to check traffic, so I don't know what I'm facing traffic wise between here and oh, oh, so I should day, day, time, um, day, day, time, um, what I'm doing, where I'm going, um, so it's oh god, blah, 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 vaccination, shut the fuck up. Uh, cold play, not better. Kids pop station has got some good stuff. I'm feeling that from. There we go. <laughs> it's actually, one of the highlights of my Thursdays. Doing 50 Cent. Singing, rapping like 50 Cent. Damn, yeah, it's the end of the song. We used four minutes of this. Ugh. God. God, I'm tired. Not even here. Feels like I'm not even here. Okay, so I was start. Okay, so I didn't check traffic. I'm, I'm going to my therapist appointment. I went to my last one and that felt like that one went pretty good. My therapist appointment before that I didn't go to. I, I mean, I did call in and cancel it in, in a timely manner, but I didn't. And she called me the next day, but I, I didn't go because I had that god awful um, sinus infection. And it had me super, super sick. Um, which, it, it, I still feel like that's lingering a little bit, but it's mostly gone. And I still haven't taken any meds to be back, so. It's not good. Oh. No, I'm not feeling that. Kinda wish I could play CD 
GGs on days like this. Oh, I like an astronaut in the ocean. Okay, let's see. Sorry, I'm kissing the focus today at all. Uh, so I'm always at my therapist's office. Um, yeah. I figured not not going because I feel super fucking depressed. Um, to the point I, I am struggling to wake up. It's um, completely defe defeating the purpose of having available therapy. So. I mean, I, I do realize I'm not getting much in the way of government benefits, but one of the few that I am getting is pre-therapy, so I, uh, damn it, fuck this light. Um, one of them is, wow, that guy ran that red light on the bike and almost got hit. Um, I hope that was visible in the video. It's angled up funny, so it's not really showing the road, it's showing the sky above the road. That's better. Um, yeah, so, I mean, that's one of the few benefits I have. I should really come in use of it. And try not to be a hypocrite. I mean, I, I know at some point I kind of, kind of am. You know, I've got a lot of things I believe in, but then sometimes I just don't even seem to keep following my own principles and beliefs. Um, but I... Uh, like government healthcare is such a hot hot button topic this these days and and um, I got a lot of really mixed feelings on that. I mean and one of my issues with it like I think socialized medicine is a good thing to a point and I've been on socialized medicine forever, so to say well socialized medicine is something that shouldn't exist is extremely hypocritical. Um, you know, and, and when I see people whose lives are destroyed because they have to, you know, get something medical done, somehow, you know, they, you know, say they're living a decent middle life, life crisis, or, oh God, I, I'm sorry, I'm, my head's not clear enough to even articulate these kind of thoughts. I was trying to say what the time of date was, wasn't I? I was trying to get that out. Um, so it's, it's 4.12 right now. Um, date, I think it's August 3rd. It's the first Monday in August 2021. I think it's August 3rd. Yeah, I'm very aware of the date because um, um, my birthday's coming up on the 6th. So I should be kind of paying attention to when that's going to happen. Not that I have any real plans for it other than doing my show on Thursday, which is the 5th, it's going to be the 6th at midnight. The last two Fridays I've seen Cece, the lead singer of the band down there, and I've been kind of tempted to ask her if it would be possible on my birthday to actually get up and maybe sing a song with the band. That would be really exciting and fun for me in that part, but I don't know, I just couldn't work up the nerve to ask her. I don't know, it's kind of funny. You know, she's sometimes her and I like really connect and we'll talk. And the last two Fridays, she seemed to be really preoccupied with the people she's talking to at the bar. I mean, she's been friendly. She's said hi to me. Before, so. Like, she's come over to me and said hi, you know, and stuff. But I don't know, we really hadn't, didn't have a conversation going on. I just didn't feel like I could, you know, interrupt the people she was talking to interrupt the people she was talking to over at, uh, you know, at the bar, and, and it's, I mean, even though she sings, it's just not her band per se, I don't know, it just seemed like it was too much to ask for. Right, maybe I can ask her on Friday, after all, it'll be my birthday then, of course, that won't really give the band any time to converse about it, but I don't know. 
That's stupid. Just stupid. Let's stay. Oh yes, I'm headed. I'm headed to therapy. Um, um, I guess. I guess one of the reasons I, 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 I like, I, I've had government health care for a long time, so I guess I've been kind of spoiled on that. And and I get like where some people who are otherwise middle class can't afford health insurance and that's that's something that needs to be fixed and can't afford health care and that's certainly something needs to be fixed and um, yeah the health care system in the United States is so crooked and I'm, I'm not even really qualified especially not in my middle state right now to give, a, give an analysis on it but it's it's pretty whack um, I don't think giving everybody free health care and turning the health care over to the government is the solution. Um, I mean, I could go off at length as to why that's not. Um, not the least of which is just, you know, I, I would like the, the weight for health care to not be comparable to the weight of the DMV. Um, and and, and I, places, I know a lot of people you know, I read about places, that, countries that have switched their healthcare hundred percent to government and have just have horrible, horrible. You know, it's very difficult to get healthcare there. Uh, horrible weights and stuff. But yeah, you know, and then and then you end up with those that have the have the means to get private healthcare. Of course, get private healthcare and they have good healthcare. So you you know, again, you've got to extreme divide between what the people who have and have not are able to get, which I guess there's no, that's inevitable in everything, including health care. Um, and you got, oh my gosh, just, my head is so cloudy today, like a house for sale, this model, what that one's selling for. I'd love to live in this neighborhood too, this is a neat little neighborhood. Okay, where was I? Oh, so I'm going to oh, therapy. I'm just kind of back rooting on instinct right now and going a route that I expect to not have traffic. Since I, I didn't have the clarity of thought to check my, uh, well, I wonder what they're building on the right here. Uh, didn't have the, wow, well, I've got a green light, even better. Um, didn't have the clarity. Oh, another car wash, cool. Forget what the small business buildings that were there. They were super run down and they've been mostly vacant for a long time. So nice to see a project of car wash coming in there. I wonder why that guy had felt the need to cut me off. Um, damn, I need the stop line. It's before you get to the shade. I could really use the shade right now. It's hot. I need my hair going here. Oh, fuck. Tell this guy to get a real productive therapy session. <laughs> wow. Um, anyway, I, so, as somebody who's done non-emergency transportation for, for different cab companies that provide transportation for the, uh, for people that are on government health care, and, and someone who's, you know, been on a, other, on government health care and seen the way other people use it, um, I, I, where is that guy going? Well, he is way past the stop line. At least he's stopping before he hits oncoming traffic, but wow. And again, there's not a sign at the stop line to make it clear this is where you stop for the people that aren't from here, so. I don't know, is this intersection clear? Apparently it's not to the guy in the white car, or maybe he just wanted to get in the shade. Maybe he just wanted to be ahead of me. Um, no, so I, I think some people like really abuse it. Like I know some people, if they feel like the slightest bit, you know, that have government health care, if they feel the slightest bit sick, or if they just in their head think they feel the slightest bit sick, they're, they're at the emergency room. I so frequently see it, you know, when I, when I actually am sick to the point where I feel like I need to go to the emergency room. And for me, that's only like if, if an urgent care is not open. Um, 
You now see a lot of people that are just in the emergency room. Just don't really seem to need to be there, but they're they've got free health care, so they go. Um, Lily's mom's somewhat of a hypochondriac. It seems like she goes for so much shit she doesn't need to. Oh no, sex. I thought that's what it was. Oh, my stomach doesn't feel good. Probably just nerves. Probably just haven't been eating. I can't remember when I was in weight class. Oh, yeah, so I've been, this is my back from, I've been back from California, I've been super depressed. I know I didn't start this way when I got back. No, I went to my show, I went to my, so I, I, I remember I vlogged. Okay, I got home and I was super tired and I slept because I didn't like pretty sleep deprived out in California due to lack of a place to stay and just taking cat naps in the car. Finally fell out on the way back and took a long nap my car on the way back uh, at a truck stop about halfway from halfway between life and Phoenix um, I don't know how long I slept there in the hours but yeah it's, 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 it's probably probably the longest slept, sleep sleep I got you know since heading to California so um, but I was still super tired when I got back so I slept really hard and um, got up did my show vlogged on the way to the show. Thanks to everybody who's watched that, by the way. I went to, uh... So I think I did two vlogs that day. I did do two vlogs that, that... Wait, no, that was Friday. It was Friday. It went on Friday. It was like Thursday. I did the show. The show was good. I mean, my Thursday karaoke show was pretty good. I had a lot of singers. I... At one point, I got like a little extra stress during the show. For the most part, I think the show went really good. Um, just, and it, it's just somebody, and it, it's the thing that usually stresses me out there. I, I get somebody who wants to request a song, but they're like so specific, and they're requesting, they're holding their cell phone up, and they're like, oh, play this, and play this, and you got your cell phone. You got that on your cell phone. Go listen to that on your cell phone. Why are you fucking bugging me? And, and of course, I don't have the songs they're asking for, you know. I, it's like it's a karaoke show. Sing, sing something. Um, just missed my turn because I was really focusing on where I was going. Um, I'm almost to my clinic, so this is going to get kind of short, short, and I don't think I've really made any point on, on this or talked about anything worthwhile other than I've shared with the world I have government health care. Um, um, Anyway, I don't want to be the hypocrite that just doesn't show up at appointments because I have no financial repercussion for not showing up. So I'm forcing myself to, to do it. So I hope it helps me. I think it's a good thing I force myself to get out of bed because I don't think I've been out of bed since Friday. And it's, I think it's, it's Monday. So three, three days. I don't know. Did I get out of bed? I don't remember there being a Saturday or a Sunday, so I'm gonna say I, I almost say I didn't. Um, I did a couple of, I did a little bit of Reddit, not much, but I did a, quite a major YouTube bender. And so I've been active in the YouTube comment section, so if you interacted with me in the YouTube comment section, that's, that's all I was, I guess. I don't know, it's something. I'm to my clinic. <laughs> well, I hope, if nothing else, my driving was good on this. And I didn't present a case for not allowing those with mental illness to have driver's licenses. I am about to lose that anyway. Um, anyway, it's 424, so I made it to my appointment on time. That's good. Um, that's good. I'm gonna try to bring some of my papers and stuff out. Maybe she'll let me go through them while I'm in there. Clarify what I need to do with my not lose my license. I can't see any way I had to get around it. Anyway, thanks for watching me fall apart. 